Welcome to Ropes Direct. This video is about how to pass a rope through a hole in a post, for decking for example, and how to get out of a jam if your post hole is still too tight. Our big message is wait for your rope to arrive and drill a test hole in some old wood first. The diameter of the hole will need to be bigger than the diameter of the rope. This is why you drill a test hole first. A 32mm manila rope. We drilled a 35mm test hole and yet it's still a bit too tight. We can just about get it through but feeding 20 metres or so of this through multiple posts won't be fun. Our next test hole in the middle of our block is 40mm which was fine. So OK to proceed and drill our actual posts. Now what do you do if you drill a post without testing first and it's too tight? Here's a 48mm synthetic hemp and imagine our block of wood is your post. We drilled a 55mm hole. We know the body of the rope should go through easily because we sized the drill bit against the rope but it bunches up as rope sometimes does. In this instance we just need to get it started. So here's the trick. We'll make the front end thin enough to push through so the body of the rope can then be pulled through without bunching. Use PVC electrical tape to bind your rope nice and tightly and use a sharp knife to carefully cut out one strand. Usual rules apply, take care, don't let children do this unsupervised. Then simply unravel the strand you want to remove and discard. We've speeded up this next bit of film. In real time we took 30 seconds to bind up the remaining two strands with PVC tape and then, importantly, bind tightly the bit further back where you cut so it'll pull through the hole smoothly. And it's easy to push the rope through without bunching. After that it's easy to pull the body of the rope all the way through. All you need to do now is cut off the two strands at the front. You can heat seal the end if it's synthetic rope or apply a knot or end fitting or whatever you've chosen to finish it with. We've got other videos all about cutting rope, heat sealed end caps and brass fittings. And of course we sell knife cutting tools, PVC tape and rope end finishes on our website to help you get the job just right. So please remember, wait until your rope arrives, drill a test hole first and enjoy your DIY for years to come.